All right, covering education tonight, Anderson County Schools starting to welcome back students this week. There's a lot of preparation, as you know, involved, especially for new teachers. Good morning, Tennessee anchor Allison Smith takes us inside Fairview Elementary, where teachers have been working hard. Anderson County teachers at Fairview Elementary are providing a back to school roadmap for students. Uh, we got to uh, plan out what color we wanted all the folders, what, what we wanted for composition books, and that way all of the students come in on an even playing field. This year, fourth grade teacher Melinda Powers and her co-teachers shopped for school supplies for their students thanks to additional funding from the school system. The district supplied every student with $40 worth of school supplies to cover the cost to parents. And now when the kids come the first day, we don't have to worry about getting all their school supplies out and trying to sort them out and trying to figure out what we're going to do with everything. They, are, they come in, they are ready to go the first day. Next door, Sarah Rahuff has been focused on creating an inviting space at a classroom that's designed to inspire. We really spend a lot of time in our classroom and I want them to want to come to school and to be excited to come to school. Teachers are also excited to bring back group pods and flexible seating for students. They want to create the best learning environment for their new family. You know, every year we meet our students. We're so excited to meet our new students and just create, you know, a good classroom environment and create, create a new family. I, it, it, they truly become my family and I miss them when they go each and every year. Covering education, Allison Smith, WATE 6 on your side. Allison, thank you. Hey, we look forward to seeing you back here tonight at 11 o'clock. Have a good night.